Hello and welcome to today's. Here we present you top 20 news of Jammu and Kashmir. Objection to Kurasi Mirwa's conversation, lowest point of Delhi's foreign policy, says Mahbuba Mufti. One person was injured in a road accident on Srinagar Leh Highway in Kangan area of central Kashmir's Gandharwal district on Thursday. Hurriyat Chairman Mirwais Umar Farooq on Monday said, Justice continues to elude the family of 7th standard student Wami Haruk Farooq who was killed after a tear gas cell fired by the police hit him in Old Srinagar city in 2010. Five civilians, two CRPF troopers wounded in Anantna grenade blast. The National Security Council Secretariat has sought data from Jammu and Kashmir government on immovable properties of Kashmiri migrants. There was fresh snowfall in the Kashmir Valley and rains in Jammu region on Thursday as the MET forecast improvement from Friday. A guard room outside the residential quarter of a senior police officer at Tulsibag in Srinagar caught fire Wednesday night, reports said. No traffic will be allowed on the Jammu Srinagar Highway on Thursday due to fresh snowfall and landslides, officials said. A day-long awareness program was organized by the Department of Health under a Sparse Leprosy Awareness Campaign in Vadgam today. Jammu and Kashmir Joint Coordination Committee of Private Schools has appealed to the Fee Fixation Committee to modify its order being barring private schools from charging one-time admission fee. Several morning flights were on Thursday morning cancelled at Srinagar Airport due to bad weather. National Conference Vice President Omar Abdullah Wednesday opposed the proposed handing over of 850 megawatt rattle power project to the National Hydroelectric Power Corporation, saying the sellout of a viable power project will have long-term negative implications on the state's economic growth. Former head of nephrology at Sheri Kashmir Institute of Medical Sciences, Dr. Gulam Has Gulam Hassan Malik has been conferred Lifetime Achievement Award by Tamil Nadu Kidney and Research Foundation. State Institute of Education, Kashmir today organized a program for children between age group of 2 to 13. Srinagar Metro Rail Project likely to get delayed by a decade. Jammu and Kashmir Integrated Child Protection Services and Child Resource Center organized a special one-day workshop to familiarize the stakeholders with the Child Line Service in Jammu Division. The State Administrative Council, which met here under the chairmanship of Governor Satyapal Malik, has approved notifying an industrial scheme which will help encourage large investment in the sector, apart from incentivizing newly established units and also the units undergoing. Union Minister Jitain Singh led the foundation for a highway village at Logate North in Kathua district of Jammu and Kashmir on Tuesday. Bharatiya Janata Party leader and former lawmaker Chandra Prakash Ganga Wednesday likened Prime Minister Narendra Modi to a deity and his scheduled rally on February 3rd at Vijaypur to Kumbh Mela. Several prominent political activists on Wednesday joined National Conference here at Sri Kashmir Bhavan Jammu Kashmir under the leadership of Additional General Secretary of the Party, Dr. Sheikh Mustafa Kamal. That's all for now. Thank you for being with us. You can watch our program once again tomorrow at the same time. Thank you.